up everybody so today we're going to take a look at the next new card that was added into the king of vermilion mini box uh, which was the other card that we were kind of waiting on which is going to be tuning and um, tuning is obviously going to be really really good for um the shooting star road deck um it's honestly it's, it's a really nice card um so it's going to be definitely going to give another reason to have the kind of um clash between you know your your red nova dragon and of course you now your new your starter your shooting star dragon um so yeah tuning is a very a very simple yet very strong card um Basically, what it does is you add one synchron tuner from your deck to your hand, and you can send the top card, uh, or then send the top card. Sorry, every uh, from your deck to the graveyard, which is really, really nice, because uh, that works as well with a lot of th all different things. It can also work for getting maybe if you're lucky and get jungle burner in grave, which you don't really need with shooting star road. Um, but it's good for stuff like glow bulb and jet synchron. That if they're in the grave, uh, or if they're in the grave, you can send the card from your hand to your graveyard, or you can send the top card to your deck to the grave um, to special summon it from the grave. Um, so that's why glow bulb is in here. It's an extra copy just because it's a little bit of an extra tech there and there. Uh, just in case we do decide to actually activate uh, tuning, we can then send gold. If global gets sent to the grave, we have that option in grave as well, which is also really nice. Tuning also works kind of nicely as well. Uh, maybe not for in this deck, but if other decks with Junk Synchron, if you top deck, um, you know, grab your Synchron and then you top deck a tuner, uh, or top deck, a, not tuner, but top deck, a, you know, like a Quibble Hedgehog or something, you know, something that you can get in grave for Junk Synchron if you're running some sort of different deck without, um, without shooting Star Road. Um, but yeah, so this deck is not, this one is, this variation is a bit different from my, a lot different from my original deck. Um, I've been taking from, because I've been seeing the time, or as the time pass, and to see what other kind of combinations people come up with, and honestly, some of the best combinations probably around this deck, um, or around these kind of cards. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what we're using, um, today. So for the whole deck we have today, we have two quick draw synchrons, we have three junk synchrons, we have one Mega Phantom Beast O-Lion, one Glow Bulb, one Jet Synchron, and two junk converters and um, we have three tuning gum uh we have um two forbidden lances three tunings and then two hate grenades in the next deck we have shooting star dragon one junk destroyer one star dragon one crawl dragon two junk warriors and then one junk archer uh yeah i've been seeing tuning gum a lot using a lot uh being tuning gum sorry being used a lot um and i think that's actually really nice because it also i realized that tuning tuning gum is actually pretty decent because at least is if it's in the grave when a card effect is activated the target's exactly one synchro monster um you can buy this card and negate the activation that helps you against karma cut a lot um obviously we are running for the lance and hey but we don't have the access to those two um we at least have tuning gum and grave to give us that free kind of that free um protection like against shooting star because obviously shooting star um can protect against being destroyed but it can protect about being banished the same with red nova which i think um which is a point that i pointed out in my <laughs> description of my last video um is that just that um looking a lot of cool new kind of cards that are being protected against being destroyed but we're not getting a lot of cards that are being protected against banishment because a lot of cards can still be banished for easily and i feel like that's kind of the downfall because of karma or downfall of some decks because of karma cut um because we banished the cards and um, but yeah tuning, tuning gum is really useful for that um this is really nice um you also try going face up monster you control that face up is treated as a tuner which is you know it's, it's kind of whatever uh but uh, the main purpose of this is just to have it in grave. Also to have it as an extra 200 for um, shooting stars so you can attack. Um, but also just have it in grave as a protection against um, thing. So yeah, we only got that's the only this tuning is the only really new card we the only new card we got with this. Um, but it is really useful. It's helpful for searching. It gives you just a bit more to search. Um, that's why I'm only going to I'm dropping down to two drone converter because especially means that we have one in grave already with shooting star road anyway. Um, but I'm also dropping down to two because um, it's tuning instead. That way we've got five cards. Um, we could have six if we wanted to, but I feel like six is probably unnecessary. Um, but yeah, with tuning, I think it's pretty good. Um, it's a pretty nice card. Um, I don't really need to go over anything else. Shooting star, same thing as always. Same shooting star, kind of trying to get the shooting star, uh, OTK. And the real thing, we got glow bulb in here now. Um, yeah, it made the deck a bit more optimized. And tuning gum is definitely going to be really good in here. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and hop on to some duels and hopefully have a good time today. So yeah, when we get in with it, guys. Alright guys, we're going to jump in with the first duel here. Um, so yeah, this should be pretty interesting. I'm hoping this will go good today. Um, yeah, it's just, it's just a nice little extra card and it makes it the deck a lot stronger. Um, it gives the deck a little bit more um, consistency, I should say. Um, of course, we're going to up against the Yusei here. Going up, we're probably going to go up against a lot of different Yuseis and a lot of different Jack Atlases. Jack Atlases. I want a 6 win streak just currently from the Red Nova stuff, but I could lose it here. I'm not going to stress over too much about losing it. I don't really... 
particularly mind. We do get turning, which is really good. Um, I don't really need it, but it is there. I have a lot of synchro on cards. Um, you know what? Let's go as well. Actually, I should have mentioned tuning is really good for tuning gum. Um, I'm gonna add this to my hand. I'm gonna hopefully send tuning gum to the grave. Uh, we did not. We sent tuning to the grave. Tuning with tuning. We're beautiful. Uh, we're already lacking in tuners, um, as you can see. Uh, so we're joke converter. Uh, and then we'll go into uh, drug warrior standard stuff. This is gonna be everything that's normal with this deck. It's everything normal. Uh, we could quick draw for in our hand, which is also like is pretty good. Um, obviously, quick draw is nice because it's the extra card that's in here just to give us that extra extra synchro ability. Um, so we can have more than just shooting star on the board if we need it. Because obviously, shooting star sometimes can let you down because sometimes it is it is um. It is purely, purely RNG based, um, whether you're actually gonna get, um, or you're actually gonna get it or not. So with that, um, we're also gonna go ahead and uh, shooting star. We're gonna go with formula synchron, and then we're just gonna end our turn. We're gonna go on. We're, not, we're gonna see if we can chain it. I think we're gonna see if we can chain it before the end of our opponent's main phase. Uh, so we're gonna see if we can tune, because I want to see if we're gonna get targeted by something. We can just uh, cancel that out. We're gonna go level warrior for no monsters. You can know, so this is a level two monster. We're gonna control some monster. So let's cover me. Okay, fair enough. Uh, into Minerva, the lights were maiden. Okay, so it's kind of like shooting star, but kind of not. He's using shooting star road, but I guess he's just using it for the junk converter, maybe. Yeah, I'll go for Michael, of course. I figured. Uh, well, you're gonna waste your Michael effect, so that's good. I guarantee your opponent's got some sort of back row uh, protection, so. Uh, it's gonna target my thing. Okay, starts dragon. And then we're gonna formula synchron, so then his effect is negated. Uh, so we're gonna go shooting star. That's why you kind of keep that. Because if I was, I was, I could lose shooting star so very easily. Um, there, so I don't want to lose that. So could have easily lost it that way. So now it's negated for that. Well, that's Michael's effect is negated for the turn, but um, still gonna have more effects. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, switch to someone. Okay, so he ends his turn. Uh, we're gonna top deck Junk Converter, which is actually like pretty good. Okay, let's see. Let's shooting star first. Go one, two, three. I got three, which is pretty good. It's enough to get the OTK. So I guess we could set that just in case. Uh, yeah, let's try it maybe. Um, Terrified here. What, well, Michael? Oh, no, it's not enough to get the other okay, because Michael can refresh. Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Ah. Okay, he just sent one. He just sent one. I guess he could only send one. And then we just win. Okay, cool. All right, bit nervous there. <laughs> bit nervous. <laughs> bit nervous. I didn't know what was going to happen there. All right, guys, we're going to jump in with the second duel here. I'm going to continue, continue the uh, the win streak here. Continue the win streak. I'm terrified to continue. I don't like continuing these streaks because I feel like they make me feel like nervous and like, oh boy, got something to lose now. Um, but we'll see. I'm going to get blue eyes here, which is just not fun. Current win streak of seven. Getting rank. I hate these win streak things because I always feel like. I don't know. It just puts pressure on you for some reason. Uh, normally, that would, I would say that's probably not too great of a hand, but it's actually not too bad. Uh, it's not too bad with with the likes. Ooh, and that's pretty good. I mean, they're all like just really good cards. Uh, can you add? You can activate tuning twice as well, which is also kind of nuts. Uh, oh, junk synchron. I'm actually gonna I'm gonna go junk converters effect, and I'm gonna add my ditch tuning because I have tuning engrave. It's gonna be huge. Uh, it's gonna be huge bugs and we'll take quick draw as well. Get that in hand because it's just gonna be really nice. Alright, now let's go for the thing. Tuning is a really nice card. It is actually genuinely a really good card and it's really gonna help with the decks to come. We could potentially OTK this guy here, potentially, but it depends on whether we actually get that OTK, is the question. Um, obviously, quick draw, we can't do much with right now. Uh, I'm not using my Boost Warrior engine, I guess you would say. Uh, not Boost Warrior, I am my. Uh, yeah, obviously I could target that as well, but I'm not going to. Uh, I could do. Um, sorry, I'm sort of thinking play at the same time. <laughs> I just, just we should play the game anyway. But uh, I could obviously do the. Um, I lost my train of thought now. 
completely lost my train of thought. What am I doing? Okay, so we have turning up and grave. I'm going to leave. I'm just going to leave it. Let's go. Let's change the road. Um, uh, grab you. We are going to go straight forward. Um, I'm going to go straight forward and see. Uh, I mean, I could get turning gum. I could get a second turning gum and grave just in case. Um, let's see. I mean, we always have, we can always hard summon quick draw synchro as a normal monster. We need that extra 800 boost, depending on how much tuners we had. Top deck here. So we got one, two, three, four. We got four. All right, let's go see if we can end it. Is it an egg? Eggy. And boom, we end it. All right, that's pretty good. Again, continuing the win streak, getting the rank up match there. Uh, pretty, pretty easy win, if I do say so myself. Uh, obviously, it's nothing too crazy to cry home about, but we got the dub, so I guess we'll just go ahead and keep it in anyway. It's whatever. I guess we could jump in with the third duel. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, I fought a Jack player, and I am um, I lost. I lost, so my win streak is gone. Um, which is unfortunate, but uh, it's whatever. I don't really care that much. It's fine. I'm just here to make fun, have or uh, make duels and have fun. I'm not really too bothered by win streaks. It's going up against another blue eyes, which is ew, icky. <laughs> don't like blue. What am I? Eight. Um, but yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna play. It's not too bad actually, because we have tuning in hand, which is also really good. I don't like the fact that I do have the. Turning gum, that's so annoying. Uh, okay, so we're not out of the woods yet. Uh, second turning. I mean, you can act the elder. You gotta tell you multiple turnings per turn, so it's not too bad. Um, okay, so we're gonna tuning. Uh, create all they ask is that I top deck a tuning gum. I'd rather, uh, no, I just bought my things. Or, no, sorry. Uh, okay, so junk uh, Okay. Oh, excuse me, guys. I'm yawning. Um, okay. Okay. All right. So, let's see here. Junk Archer. Junk Archer. Junk Warrior. Um, and then into Zolt. Into this. Um, okay. So, before I actually... i tell you what I'll do. Okay. I like having the protection with Tuning Gum, so I probably will try and get an Engrave with Quick Draw. Um, which is really nice. Or I could do some other... Actually, can't I? No, I can't, because... I need some wind monsters for this to turn. Uh, alright, so... Shooting star, shooting star, star. I mean, we could still get the OTK. We can still get it. It just depends on how much tuners we actually top tech. Um, depends on how much we top tech. Uh, which, obviously, we're ever going increasingly lose. Uh, no. Two... Three, four, <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, okay, let's go tuning. Second tuning, because you can activate tuning multiple turns, but multiple times per turn. Tuning gum, maybe? Second quick draw. We're really just not getting the cards I need. Okay, there's tuning gum and grave. Uh, okay, so let's go in here. Obviously, gonna cancel my attack, but I can still attack the maiden anyway. Grab your one free blue eyes. Grab your one free blue eyes. My dragon, the defense position. Uh, and then boom, and then boom, and then boom. And then we end our turn. I mean, it doesn't give us the win. We were close to getting it, but because of Maiden, we don't get the dub because of stupid yeah, Maiden's effect. But um, maybe I have one more turn to do it. Protected against one thing. I really want to take like, a Lance here. That's what I really want. I really want Lance. Um, egg plus econ. Hmm. People have tried to tell me before. Let's see if it works for this guy. Uh, I mean, oh yeah, I have tuning. The one I just say no. You know what? I'll say no. I would risk it because it would be really funny if my opponent didn't get enough tuners. But I'm not. I don't really want to risk it because like Sage is a tuner. And more eggs are tuners. Like I do, because I don't know how many things he has. I don't want him to just literally beat me. It sucks I have to lose the tuning, but, um, that's a blast in hand. He's gonna go for a thingy, isn't he? He's gonna go for yoke. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm a bit nervous. A bit, bit nervous, because, oh, it's two blows. A bit nervous, because, like, um, this is fine. Can't do Neo. There's no Neo. Neo can 
kind of shuts your Ningstar down very easily because Neo can just come in and be like, Neo, goodbye. Oh, I'm an idiot. There's no Karma Cut to worry about because he doesn't have, he's gone for Tomb Burst. And I was thinking, get rid of my Quick Draw. Eh, whatever. GG, I guess. <laughs> um, we should be fine here, though. It'll be whatever. Uh, no. Nah, attack my Quick Draw now, which is fine. There's no battle. There's no. I just leave. Does he leave? No. There's no, there's no yoke anyway. There's no, uh, Karmica. What was I saying? I'm, I'm losing track today. I'm losing track of my thoughts today. Uh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right. So, Nuttic, Atronade. Sure, I'll feel comfortable having it back in the hand anyway, so why not? Screw it. And take it back to your hand. Uh, I feel like it doesn't really matter. One, two, um, three, three. So, um, oh, I can't be destroyed by battle. I forgot about that. I can't be destroyed by battle. I forgot I can't be destroyed by battle. Um, I actually almost forgot about that, but I can just attack into it repeatedly anyway, which is honestly kind of funny. <laughs> Alright, guys, we could jump in with the fourth and final duel here. We'll do one more quick fourth, fourth duel to end things off, and then we'll see how it goes. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping it won't be too long if I put this fourth duel in here, but that better not be what I think it is. Okay, I saw the Kaiba icon. I know it wasn't uh, Dark Side Dimensions one, but I saw the Kaiba icon and I was like, mm, I don't know about that one, Chief. Um, looks like we're gonna end things off with a bit of a mirror match here, or another one, well, kind of another one. I, whoops, I don't really like fighting mirror matches too much. Um, mirror matches kind of are not great because the problem with mirror matches is, is it's just you you and your opponent constantly. Just Banishing as you're back and forth, I swear to god. Uh I mean we can use Forbidden Lance to lower his his shooting star, but then he'll just banish our you shooting star's effect to go out. um I don't even know what to do here, man. I don't even know what to do. Junk Warrior. I'm I'm really thinking here. I'm I'm thinking the only the only option really is to maybe go for junk destroyer, but I feel like if I go for junk destroyer then when that card of activated that would destroy a card on the field I could he would stop me but um, even though I can't stop my own cards from being destroyed for some freaking reason I don't know why um I just feel like I'm not sure what that, I'm a bit of a loss because the mirror matches are really kind of kind of bad they're really bad um, I mean, I don't think, maybe not because we could potentially we could lower his attack with shooting star right and if we get more than you know Two attacks, I guess. Uh, yeah, I need more than two attacks. If I get more than two attacks, then I could possibly win. Because I get to lower his attack with Lance. He doesn't have a tuning gum, so he ain't stopping anything in the grave. Um, um, why are you taking so long? It's not difficult to pick Shooting Star. Okay, I was worried. I was like, what's happening? Um, yeah, okay, so we could try it, which would be a great way of winning. Uh, we can also send it back or back to the hand with We don't need to. So let's see. We got trick, quick draw synchro, which is really good, really good, really good. Okay, so let's go junk synchro. Um, let's plan it a bit here. Uh, let's plan it a bit here. Uh, okay, let's plan it a bit. Uh, junk warrior, same thing. It's the same goddamn thing. Don't have tuning here, but it doesn't really matter. Um, so it's the same thing. It just doesn't matter. And then junk converter again. Like I don't really want to risk trying to go for junk destroyer. Also, junk destroyer can't really get us the win anyway. Okay, so let's see here. It depends. It all depends. It all comes down to pretty much whatever I can draw here. Whatever I can draw. Um, whatever I can draw to help me win. Uh, how many tuners I can get here? It depends on how much tuners I can get. Uh, I can still beat over him with his monster. Um, shooting star. We can use Forbidden Lands to get over him. Lower his attack by 800. Let's see. We need like three attacks. We need three. Though. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's do. Okay. One. And then one. We got one. We literally got one. That's incredible. It's actually incredible. Wow. All right, so let's just send two up to the grave, uh, and then set that. I'm gonna send the Forbidden Lance, and then we're gonna end our turn. 
Um, alright, that's bad. That's really bad. We only got one attack. That this this fight could have been done and over pretty easily, but it's now not because my opponent has saying he's got his own junk cyclone as well. Ah, uh, okay, we have turning gum anyway, so it's not too bad. Let's see what he does. Um it's got another five star. I mean he's got access to another eight star, access to junk destroyer, which again is Actually, Junk Star, no, yeah, but Junk will protect against Junk Destroyer because he still will only, still only have enough to target one card on the board. I mean, you can target my quick draw, but, like, who cares? Uh, okay, so grab your thing. Go right here, of course. Grab your Junk Synchron. Yada, yada, yada. He's gonna go for another eight star of some kind. I uh, can't do it to more than one shooting star, so there's that. Um, sure, he's there's effect activate. Grab no attack, please. One. You have an egg? You're using blue eyes to three? Is that like a tuner? I can't remember. Uh, really using that freaking thing? Are you kidding me? I mean, good news if he targets me. Um, we're fine. Uh, no, that would be stupid. That would be really silly to stop my own attack like that. Uh, okay, so you're gonna go for the negation. Check this one out, Chief. No. Check this one out, Chief. Check this one out, Chief. Check this one out, Chief. <laughs> yeah, get wrecked. There he goes, his shooting star. Um, which is pretty good. Now we need to draw attacks. We need attacks. That's what we all need is attacks. He's also running blue eyes for some reason. Whatever reason that is, I don't know. Tuning, which is also, you know, it's a good card. But... Okay, so we got one. Two. Got two, man. We only got two. Um, which is just not enough to win. Um, it's not enough to win. It literally isn't just not enough. Oh, I got Mega Phantom Beast online. Which would give us access to Coral Dragon. Um, which could get us to win, actually. So I guess we could do it. Give us access to Coral Dragon. He has access to Coral Dragon, which would be kind of nice. So I guess we'll go for Coral Dragon. Eh, we'll guess the one. Because we got to uh, Coral Dragon. Yeah, because that's, that's the win. Alright, we'll ditch the Hydronade. I'm hoping that'll be fine. Ditching the Hydronade is... No, sounds like a terrible idea. Uh, did we get the win? Mm, and yeah, boom, we got the win. Cool. Alright guys, that's going to conclude today's video, and as you can see, um, as you can see, tuning makes a nice addition to the deck, and it is really, really good. Um, it's the same thing, which is, it's just kind of the same shtick with, kind of same spiel with the Resonator Call, it's just pretty good, it's a really good searcher, and you can also use it multiple turns, uh, multiple turns per turn, there is no one turn limit on it, which is also really, really, really nice. Um, but yeah, so it's pretty standard stuff, I mean, everything else, nothing else is really new, it's just to showcase tuning. Um, but yeah, I think it is, I think it's, it's pretty good. Um, but yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the vid, if we did, hit the like button, if you enjoyed, hit the subscribe button, follow me on Twitter, that is down below in the description, and yeah, I'll catch you guys next video. Peace out, guys.